Hi everyone, I'm going to give you a quick tour of an AdTran Total Access 900E. Let me get that to focus on there. Total Access 900E. Alright, doesn't want to focus on there. Okay, so on the front you've got some status lights. You've got um, your power powered up and ready to run status light. Uh, you've also got three Ethernet interfaces. You've got a Gig1, an ETH1, an ETH2. And those are on the back. I'll show you those in a minute. And then also there's status lights for four T1s. Now right now this unit has one T1 connected to it, which is turned up. So that's why that's green. There are slots for three other T1s, which are not being used right now. Also, if we had Ethernet co uh, ports connected to this, you'd see you know, uh, a green light next to one of these ports if it was being used. Now let's go around to the back and see what's going on back there. Now this is, this is a, kind of like a multi-service router, so you can have voice on here as well as data. So starting at the left here, we've got an Amphenol connector for voice. So that would be something you would connect to an Amphenol connector and then uh, the other end would go to a 66 block or a 110 block where you could break out the individual voice lines. Got an FXO port. Um, that's an analog voice port. I'm not sure if that would be used either as a dial up or a dial in or a dial out, but um, that is an analog voice port, not an ethernet port. These are your four T1s. You've got T10, T1, 0, T1 2, 3, and 4. So like I said, you could have up to four T1s uh, connected into this uh, one router. Here's those three Ethernet ports I was talking about. You've got Ethernet 1 and 2, and then you've also got a gig. So my guess is these are probably 10100 ports, and then this is a 10100 slash 1000 uh, port. You've got a USB connector, and that would probably be either used for, for some kind of console access or maybe to upload files through some kind of USB medium. Here's your craft port. It's just a nine pin serial port. So that's what you use to connect to a serial cable to your PC or your laptop to do console access with, you know, like Hyperterm or um, with Putty. And you got a battery backup connector. And then finally you've got your power connector. And of course the ground, which we're not using today, but there's the ground. Anyway, so that is a AdTran Total Access 900E. Thanks for watching.